Good morning. Um, you have actually missed a lot here. So let me just catch you up as I take you along my day. First things first, while we're in the bathroom, let's, let's show you this. So this is actually just the fan and the pot light, but you can see here, there's still some damage like there, there, uh, right around here, and then like above my head. And then there was also a patch that went in, in here. So basically there was a big old leak in my shower. I'll insert a picture of like when it was the worst here. Um, honestly, the leak itself wasn't that bad. It could have been so, 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 so much worse, but it was still annoying to deal with. Like at this point, it's been a week and a bit, um, and obviously like it's not fully repaired yet. So I'm happy that it's somewhat dealt with, but the guy is coming later today to finish up, I guess like all of what he's been working on. So since he's coming and everything is gonna get all like dusty and dirty, I need to clean up the bathroom because the current state not great. I've just been like putting everything in my big drawers while I'm dealing with it and just like shoving things in my closet because I obviously don't want all of my stuff to get super dusty. I need to refill my little lotion guy. Oh, yeah I do. <laughs> How do I push it back down? Second update is that I actually got a job. Um, no, it's not a full-time gig, although I am deep in an interview process for one right now. I got a part-time job, and this part-time job is one that I was talking about like literally months and months and months ago, like last August, September type vibe. And if you didn't know, I'll get the ramble again, but I was laid off at the end of September and I was supposed to start this job in like October, um, but I was like, honestly, this is not the vibe for right now. I didn't know how EI worked. Like I just, there were too many variables and I just wanted to have like an actual mental break. But this job is working with puppies. It's so cute. So I work for a company called Puppy Sphere. And basically we run a bunch of like private and public events with puppies. So the public one is generally speaking puppy yoga. So let me just show you some of the videos from, or some of the pictures from this weekend. So I worked on Friday. And look at this little guy. This is Astro, I think. He's so sweet. Look at this, look at this live. He's just yawning. Wait. So cute. But yes, it is part-time, so I'm only I'm honestly only working like once in April because we're going to California. So that will actually be a decent focus of this week's vlog because I have a lot of clothes coming and shoes actually that will be hopefully delivered this week for my trip and we're just gonna try everything on together i'll honestly probably pack in this vlog too and i'm so excited so my parents are staying in palm springs for all of april crazy <sighs> guys i may have gone a little overboard and this is only from one store and i ordered from like six okay so both of these packages are from abercrombie i'm just gonna open it and then we'll talk through what's inside oh okay this makes way more sense i did an order from hollister and an order from abercrombie so this is the hollister one this is a little bikini top i didn't realize it was ribbed but i think it's cute you can't even see cute vibes yeah okay and then i got another bikini this one is like white and blue floral vibes okay so this bathing suit the top looks like so i really like the pattern it's cute i got that in a small and then the bottom is also in a small okay they have a little v on the front which is vibes and then the back not terrible coverage honestly like pretty decent okay and a lot of the stuff from abercrombie you will see a theme because i currently only have one pair of shorts so I obviously need more than that. And these are um, mom short, like cargo. I'm getting somewhat see-through vibes. We'll have to try these on to figure out what's going on. It is a stretchy waistband. I also don't know if these are looking super like kid shorts. So we'll see. Okay, next I got these little baby tees. I got a blue, a green, similar color to this, just a little bit, um, what color, lighter. Really like those. I'm obviously gonna try all this on and figure out what I actually wanna keep. And then I just got a little tube top because I don't have one and I'm a little worried this might actually be too big. It's a small, just a little tube top. I've been wanting one. So yeah, that's that. And then the last thing I'm really excited for, it's actually a sweatsuit, but the pants are, sorry, my laundry's going kind of loud, 
but the pants are not like jogger sweatpants style they're like a little bit more flared and i've never had one of those so i'm excited to see the vibe I, see medium. No, I also love the color those are wide legs okay they might be kind of long but we'll see and then the matching hoodie my vibe for this is um airplane outfit okay that's package number one i'm gonna charge my battery for a second and then we'll go through package number two for the Abercrombie. okay i just unwrapped all the Abercrombie stuff and it's a lot i got doubles of most things just to like figure out the sizing especially for the shorts so let's just get into it first things first i got this electric blue um bathing suit i think it would look really good with my light complexion and stuff so it's just this little scoop neck and then high rise cheeky bottoms of the exact same suit in like a more muted blue so i'm obviously only going to keep one of them and kind of decide which one i like better on myself and then i also got this brown one which is a bit of a different style and honestly this looks way too big because i don't really have boobs and then this one is different though it's like crinkly versus just a rib on the other ones and then i got this cardigan which if you know me you know i love a cardigan and this one is fun because it only has these two buttons the rest is just like open and vibey okay now getting into the shorts this is the only one that i only got one pair of i'm pretty sure i got another i think maybe it was just shipping separately or something but just the sloan tailored short and then we've got the dab short which is just this like black color 26 27 the high rise mom short and what color is this no clue no idea got this 26 27 as well Everything, just assume it's gonna be a 26 or 27. These ones, I don't think I love this wash though. And then we got these ones which are the same as the first pair of blue denim except in curve love because always curious to try the differences. And then the final pair of shorts that we got. And by pair, I mean literal pair of shorts is these little black cutoff ones. So that is the haul for now. I'm not gonna try anything on yet. I think I'm honestly, gonna put everything that I got into this giant box and then once everything comes I will do a full try on maybe on like Thursday it's only Monday right now so I'm gonna do that and then do everything all at once so I can decide like in more real time what I like and what I don't like but I am gonna organize it honestly I might try on the sweatsuit before all of that because I'm just really curious Ooh, okay I definitely love this color it's so cozy and the pockets, or the pants do have pockets. I kinda love it. Welcome to my balcony, friends. I don't know how loud it is. I hope it's not too loud because there's like, obviously, the sounds of the city around me. But this is something that I've honestly been doing any afternoon that it's like warm out uh, or sunny out because it's just so lovely. I get direct west sunlight. I should put this one. I get direct west sunlight every single day for like, I don't know, eight hours. No, that's definitely too many hours, but like something like that. And it has been such a game changer in our last apartment. We were northeast, so we didn't really get any direct sunlight ever, <coughs> which was not ideal. But now we're like basking in it. We have to close our blinds sometimes because it's too bright. It's such a different life. Anyways, I like to come out here and just like, chill right now because i'm very very sore from my workout yesterday i'm just gonna do some massage gunning just to try and make myself feel a bit better but oh my god guys if you are in toronto and you have the flexibility to go to a workout class on mondays at 1 15 or wednesdays at 1 15 please go to sweat tonics mobility flow with justin no julian ho the class is so good it's like these tiny little movements like stretching I don't even know it's like flexibility in a traditional sense with like some yoga poses some breath work but then it's also doing these like small movements to get into the little crevices of your joints to like make yourself more mobile <clears throat> and i just and i just love it so much i actually train shut up i started a list of all of the mobility like movements that they do that i really really like and look my note is getting so long and that's just kind of like because i want to be able to eventually do it on my own and like do the flows on my own time versus like having to go to this class every single monday in the middle of the day 
and I also want to do it a little bit more frequently than just once a week. So I've been compiling this list and I'm so excited, but also now that I actually have this list going, anytime that I come out of a yoga class or a Pilates class or this mobility class and there was like some little move that I found to be a little bit difficult because of my lack of flexibility or something like that, or if I find that it's just like a super small movement, I write it down in here. And I have just been absolutely loving it. So stay tuned for me to like figure out this mobility journey that we're on. But for now, I'm really sore. Let's gun. And I'm actually gonna go back to Sweat and Tonic shortly and meet Sarah there. And we're just gonna have a little like work session in Tonic House. So let's gun and then we'll go. Tuesday, we haven't chatted yet, but we are approaching 2.15 and it's been a busy day. Honestly, it hasn't, but I'm gonna pretend that it has. I went to a workout class today at 12.05 and that was a blend. So the blend classes are like half Pilates, half yoga flow. It was so fucking hard and I'm still sore from Sunday. So like the body is hurting. Anyways, I just got more stuff. <laughs> also look at this outfit. I have my workout fit still on like actually ridiculous but if you hear noise in the back i'm gonna have a shower it's just warming up right now so while it's warming up i want to give you the haul so i got some stuff from dynamite so i'm just gonna show you i'm not gonna try anything on yet because i don't want to but first things first this cutie little you're too tall yeah i'm gonna stand against right now this <laughs> cutie little tank it's hot pink and it's like this little crinkly vibe and then i also got it in this like blue color i feel like that could be nice on my like, complexion and stuff and then i got this little vest moment knit vest in black and in white and in a small and an extra small because things like this just always fit me really weird because of my lack of boobs so oh it came undone that's a red light okay good to know but anyways i got it in black and then i also got it in the two colors or two sizes in white so i'm excited for that and then final thing from dynamite is just this little like light crochet cropped you can't even see the cropped sweater so we'll try all of this on later like i mentioned yesterday and then i also got three new pairs of on cloud sneakers um i have the roger look at my hair <laughs> the roger advantage right now and i've had them for honestly almost three years i got them in may or june of 2021 and it's obviously 24 right now so <clears throat> they need to be replaced so i got three different pairs because i wasn't sure which style i liked but they're all in like various rogers so i'm just gonna pull them out and then we'll try them on honestly i probably will do it right now but i have sweatpants on so it's not fine Okay, first pair are the Clubhouse 2. I think these are the most expensive options. And I like them. They're like more actual sneaker vibes. Okay, first thought, I like. And I got all of them in a six because that's what I have my other ones in and I do have time to eat. Next, we have the Center Court, which look pretty similar to the originals, but they have a different sole. Okay, so that's that. And then the final pair is just the OG Advantage. So yeah, these are the ones I have right now. Yeah. Okay, honestly, side by side, they all look pretty similar. So it's gonna be mostly a vibe check once I put them on my feet. But this is what we're working with. From the top, I would say, I like this one the best, which is the Clubhouse, I think. No, I don't remember. It was the second one, uh, Center Court. I don't know, these ones are most like sneaker sneaker, like sneakerhead vibe, like dunk vibe. And then these ones are both pretty similar. I honestly think I like these ones a bit. Oh, it says, nope, it just says the Roger. 
I think I like these ones a bit more just because the stitching. I don't know if you can tell. They're just a little bit more like detailed, which I think elevates them a bit. But again, I'm just gonna try them all on and suss out the vibes. But I have officially decided I'm gonna get in the shower now. I'm not gonna try these on.